everyone, welcome to episode 21 of Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 3, and the last part we rescued Dad! Dad, you alright? Yes, I think so. Hey, random fat man! Oh, well, the computer sustained damage during the incident. I needed to expect. Yes, fat man says the right things for this. Oh, thank you, and... Ouch. Dad! Well, that's totally very low-res sounding sirens. <laughs> oh, Game Boy Advance, I, I, hate, I love you, but I hate your sound chip at times. Doctor, will, will Dad be okay? And where is your TARDIS? Okay, good, at least you'll live, because uh, no one can die in a Mega Man game except people have already have. I'm looking at you, people, in Battle Network 2. It was all my fault. The Scilab attack, Dad's injury, everything. I thought I was so great being called the hero of ACDC. I helped match. I helped World 3! <laughs> Lan. Oh, hi, Mom. And Lan, stop being like Luke from Tales of the Abyss. You're not that bad. So you made a mistake, so what? <laughs> Don't live in the past. Look towards the future. Believe in the me that believes in you. When? Why don't we go home? And back home. Yeah, for some reason this entire part, all my edits are just faded and played black out. Oh, look. Finally, I have all the Tetra codes. All I have to do now is obtain Alpha's data, and the Net Society is over. <laughs> delete, delete, delete. Drillman, come forward. Drillman. You summoned me, Lord Viley. Yes, I am entrusting the Tetracodes to you. Use your abilities to bring me Alpha. Failure will not be tolerated. Thanks to Mr. March. I'm... Uh, I don't even know how to voice this guy. will be easier than drilling through plywood. <laughs> I crafted you my, well my navy of destruction. Overconfidence can be costly, however. Stay vigilant. Yes, my lord. I will not fail you. Alpha will be yours. Go then, drill man, for the sake of anarchy. Delete. Why'd I make him who... I forget that guy's name even. <laughs> my plan is perfect, if I do say so myself. Even if drill man should fail, that other one can always... Deliver Alpha's data to me. <laughs> Enjoy you and what so far you can, Net Society. The time for my revenge has come. Delete. Stop being a Cyberman and or the guy from Death Note. <laughs> I'm evil. I wonder if Lan's okay. He's been absent for three days. His father is badly injured. He almost died. If only it was you. That's enough to shake anyone up. Yeah, I, do you want to go to Lance after school today? Yeah, two cute girls like us paying a visit. Lance sure to cheer up. Right, let's settle then. Well, I'll say for their age, Melo's cute, but uh, yeah, I, you're like three years younger than him, aren't you? I can't remember. And holy crap, Lance not wearing his skates. My mind is broken. Lance, how about we go to school tomorrow? I don't want to go. Everyone's probably worried about you. Hey, full school tomorrow for me is the last day of sophomore year, yeah! Lan, we're nowhere in there. May Layla and I came to cheer you up. See? What did I tell you? Let's let them in. I don't want to see anyone. Come on, Lan. They came because they care about you. That's what she said. You've been through a lot, Lan. How's your father doing, Lan? He's a lot better, but Mom called and said he needs rest. Oh, and your mother? She hasn't left that side. Hey, Lan, come back to school. Everyone's worried about you. They say you solved the Bat World 3 incident, you know. It's hard to celebrate without the hero in class. What is it, Lan? Are you feeling sick? Go home, both of you. What's wrong, Lan? Is it something we said? Just go home. Or just go leave me alone. Go home. Just forget about me. I'm fine. Fine, then. Be that way. Come on, Maylou. Let's go. 
Uh, okay. I don't understand why I, I... Nah, forget what I was about to say. I can't believe I forget what I was about to say anyway. I'm an idiot. Don't you think that was a bit little too much, Lan? I mean, I know how you feel, but they only came just because they care. I know, I know. But I'm no hero. After what I've done. How am I supposed to show my face at school? How long are you going to sulk? What is done is done. All you can do is to, to accept it and make amends. It isn't fair for you to take it out on yourself. And your friends. That must be them again. Let's go down and apologize. Reluctant land is reluctant. And yeah, he has his skates back on. His feet are weird. Oh, hi, Eggshell. I'm sorry for what I said. Hmm. Whatever you did, you're talking to the wrong person. N John, what are you doing here? I'm here on official business. Nah, don't tell me here to arrest me. What are you talking about? I'm here to pass on a request from the officials. What? A request for me from the officials? Do you know what the Tetra Codes are? Tetra Codes... Aren't they what World 3 has been after? I've heard of them, but never saw any. There are four codes in all. They are the key to a door. A door? A door that seals the immensely powerful beast away. World 3 scum wants to use the Tetra Codes to awaken the beast. The beast. Do you mean that thing called... Alpha? Yes. I have not been informed about what, who exactly Alpha is. Only a select few officials know that information. However, one thing is for certain. If Alpha is awakened, then its society will be annihilated. So, World 3 has hit the school, the zoo, the hospital, and now Scilab. That means... They have all four Tetra Codes. Yes, the net society is on the brink. We have one last resort to put an end to World 3's threat. A last resort? Yes, the Forbidden Program. It can freeze Alpha. According to our sources, that program is in the internet. It's important that a navy named S is in possession of it. Let me guess. The officials want me to locate this guy S, get the Forbidden Program, and bring it back, right? If you know so much, why don't you just do it yourself, John? Proto Man and I are too well known as officials. The denizens of the internet despise us. You, however. Yeah, but th isn't this a f the official's job? Sorry, Chad, but I can't help you out. Well, this is a dangerous mission, but... That's not it. You really want to know? Fine, I'll tell you. You know how Scilab was sabotaged? It happened because I stupidly helped Match. I didn't realize it then, but I helped out World 3. I don't have the right to take on a mission from the officials. Stop talking. If you tell me anymore, I'll have to arrest you. Uh, as an official. Chad. Land, go visit your father in the hospital. If you change your mind later, come to the virus lab at Scilab. What would you just told me? I never heard it. I owe that much for what you did for me. Dad, by the way, Land's dad's in the exact same room Yai was in, so just, just remember that. Chad. Land, let's go see dad. Okay. What the- You! So Wiley used you to form the Net, uh, Net Mafia Syndicate's gospel. Hey, we're bail, I were two the throwback. Is that right, Sean? Yes, if that's true. I lost both my parents in a plane crash. I was totally devastated. I spent my days in the cyber world as an escape from reality. One day in the night, I was approached by an unfamiliar Navi. And that Navi was operated by Wiley? Probably. Anyway, the Navi asked me, would you like to rule the cyber world? Fed up with the real world, I started doing whatever the Navi told me. Without question. I see. Then what? I expanded the syndicate as ordered and commanded others to commit crimes. That's when the Navi told me to build it. It. What did he tell you to build? The ultimate Navi. Base. He said an ultimate Navi was... necessary in order to rule over all of Cyberworld. There's someone there. Sorry, didn't mean to eavesdrop. Man, you're looking good, Sean. Let's talk more some other time, okay, Sean? Okay, I'd better get going. See ya, Lan. Ah, uh, you going already? Yeah, I have to go to Scilab now. I'll see you around. Well, good to see you're doing well after the, after the ending of Battle Network 2, even though we never learned your name in it. I had to tell you guys what it was. Sean was the former kingpin of the Not Mafia Gospel. I get to get 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 get
Ever since Gospel's collapse, he's been going to various places almost every day, sharing what he knows with others. He's trying his best to make amends for the crimes he's committed by helping us with our investigations of World 3. Sean's making up for the crimes he's committed. All I'm doing is turning in running guilt and self-pity. Hmm, is something wrong, Lan? Dad, there's something I have to tell you. Some time later. Two hours later. Lan, you did the right thing by telling me all this. I'm so sorry. You made a major mistake. But you can't dwell on it forever. Like Sean, you should do your best to make amends for the mistake you've made. If you can't do all that, you ha all you have left is regret. All you have left is regret. Impossible! Dad, I'll do it. I'll do everything I can. I've got to make up for what I've done. That's my boy. Never give up, Lan. Mega Man, let's go to Scilab. You mean to see Chad? Right. See you later, Dad. By the way, you got an email right after that scene. That little box in there is a virus meter. It's a bit of a side quest that gives you chips. Chad, tell me more about the freaking program. So I see you finally come around. Yeah, thanks to you, I finally come to my senses. Me, I don't recall doing anything. Anyway, I'll brief you on the mission details. First, though, I must warn you that this is a particularly dangerous mission. You could even lose Mega Man. Ugh. I don't mind. I'm ready to take risks like that. Let's do this, Lan. Thanks, Mega Man. Okay, Chad. Mega Man and I can accomplish any mission, no matter what the odds. Very well. I'll continue then. According to the official's investigation, the internet has a system simply referred to as the ranking. The ranking? There are ten navvies ranked one to ten in the internet. Unranked navvies cannot even meet ranked ones. The navvy called S, whom you will be seeking, appears to be a ranked navvy. So, in order to meet this guy S, I need to become ranked two. But how do I do that? That's still under investigation. I guess we should go to the internet and look around. That's the mission. Here's something that may help you. Ooh! What's this? Install it in program to Mega Man. When you go to the other square, it emits that uh, blah, 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 blah. Pretty much, it's a disguise that'll allow the under you to access under square. So basically, if Mega Man has this installed, he'll look like a bad guy. Got it! Alright, Mega Man. Let's go. Roger. So let's head on over to Undernet 3. Booyah! Go up the path where the Navi was. This is just me trying to recall where the Undersquare is, because this place took me a while to find my first playthrough. Head left, head left, and talk to this guy. If you have Black Mind equipped, he'll you can let you pass, and welcome to the area of the Undersquare. Oh, I hate the background of this place. Anyway, this place doesn't have much going for it, although I do like the color scheme of it for some reason. There's a program shop in the top right, which I'm going to show off later. There's another Simon Says guy in the bottom left corner, along with the uh, shop, which I purchased all the HP memories from. Because I have a lot of money. Well, not anymore, at least. Because, uh, 50,000, 45,000, 29,000, 9,000. It's over 9,000! But anyway, the guy you want to talk to, here's the program shop, by the way, uh... The most useful one is e leaf HP plus 300, but so freaking big. So yeah. <laughs> the guy you want to talk to is down here. And there he is. Stand in front of the statue in the middle of the square. Alrighty then, this totally isn't suspicious. Then again, this is easily one of my favorite sections of the game. You were told to wait here. But is this really the right spot? You think we were tricked? This is the internet. There may be a lot of false info going around. Woo! I can take this. Uh, this might be difficult. Let's do it. Okay, I'm screwed. <laughs> we're surrounded. Mega Man, watch out. Who knows what'll happen next? Man, the statue's speaking. It said ranked. Yeah, what do we have to do to become ranked? So pretty much, we need this is pretty much a survival of the fittest round. We need to find these guys all over the internet, undernets, and take them out. 
They're all scattered out the three undernet areas, and they can be a bitch to find. Although, the first four are pathetically simple. They're right outside the first warp. Hey, Lamb, let's go, too. There are no rules. Who knows what these undernet navvies will do. Probably send viruses after us. All right, Mega Man, let's show them what we got. Roger. However, we're going to end up doing that next time on Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 3. Thank you guys for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. And next time, we'll fight those ten navvies. See you guys then.